Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over two new features in Toonly. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. One of the most requested features in Toonly is finally here. The ability to change the aspect ratio of your Toonly videos. We've also included a new integration with Takia, which means you can now import your voiceovers from Takia directly into Toonly. Plus, the team squashed a few bugs and made a few minor improvements in Toonly version 1.9.5. Ready to get started? First, make sure to update Toonly when prompted so that you're working with the latest version. You'll see here that I have a square video, which in the past it was only going to be your standard horizontal video. Being able to customize your aspect ratios in Toonly is a game changer for content creators looking to tailor their videos for the different platforms out there. So what exactly is an aspect ratio? It's the width to height ratio of your video canvas. It determines how your video fits into various viewing areas, such as on a TV screen, a computer monitor, or a mobile device. And changing the aspect ratio couldn't be easier in Toonly. So here's how you do it. You go up here, and right now you see I'm at one to one, which is the square. So this top width is the exact same height as the height, okay? So width to height. Now, if I went to 16 by nine, this is your standard one, okay? This is what Toonly used to always be. And you'll notice as I change it, you may have to change your assets sizing and position to just take advantage of the screen size itself. So in this case, we have like 16 units going across versus only nine going up, okay? You also have another horizontal option, which is two to one. I'm gonna zoom out a little so you can see it. So two to one, it's basically like two squares put together side by side, okay? This is would be one unit, and then over here, there's two of those units, okay? So that's two to one. And then four to three, and again, this is also a horizontal format. It's closer to a square, but it's got just an extra unit over here onto the side, okay? So there's four, so you had four imaginary units of equal length. The same would be over here, one, two, but only three of them. And then of course, your one-to-one, -one, which was the square. And then we have the opposite of 16 by nine. So here's 16 by nine. The opposite is nine by 16, and you see it's vertical. And again, I would make some adjustments to take advantage of the aspect ratio. Then finally, we have three to four. Also a vertical format, but with a little different look to it. Next up, we have the Takia integration. So if you have the Boomly Cloud subscription, then you have Toonly and Takia and all of the other programs in the Boomly Cloud family. Now, in the past, if you wanted to bring a Takia voiceover into Toonly, you'd have to create it, export it, and then import it into Toonly. And that's easy enough, but it gets even easier with this integration. So let's head over to Takia and let's create a new project. Hit create. I'm going to add some text in here. I'm going to use Lydia and I'm going to go ahead and add it to my timeline. And just be careful on the um, audio volume here. I'm going to put it down to 38%. I just want to make sure that it's not blown out when I bring it into Tunely. One of the most requested features in Toonly is finally here. And that sounds fine. So I'm gonna hit save and then I go into Toonly and I'm in the audios tab. And then over here, I wanna choose Takia projects and I can either scroll through until I find it or I could just type it in. Toonly integration, here it is. And I'm just gonna bring it down here to my audio track. 
And let's have it come on after my lady comes on. And I'd like her to speak it. So let's go ahead and select my lady and click on the gear icon. Choose lip sync and select Tunely integration. And let's hit play. One of the most requested features in Toonly is finally here. The ability to change the aspect ratio of your Toonly videos. A new integration with Talkir means you can... And there you have it. Two cool new features in Toonly 1.9.5. I hope this gives you some ideas. Thank you for watching.